okay in the previous class uh, we discussed uh, the need of a balanced search tree and i will come to that topic once again so that you will get a continuation about the topics that i am discussing in the next few videos okay suppose that uh, you have a uh, tree general binary tree where we need to insert numbers uh, let's say 1 2 3 4 5 etc to let's say 7 so uh, this is not just a binary tree binary search tree so in this case what we will do is we will create a tree uh, binary tree so the first element is 1 so we will insert 1 then the next element is 2 the 2 will go to the right side next element is 3 3 comes here then 4 and 5 and 6 and 7 and if you want to insert numbers uh, let's say from uh, 7 6 5 4 all the way down to 1 then the insertion will be of like uh, you have uh, 7 first then on the left side you will have 6 again on the left side you will have uh, 5 you will have 5 then 4 then 3 2 1 so this is actually a skewed nice. tree we can call this one as a right skewed tree and this one is a left skewed tree so the problem with this particular structure is there is no difference between this tree that is a binary search tree and a linked list or a doubly linked list so if you want to perform operations like insertion or search or deletion then all you have to do is you will have to look at each element one by one then this particular structure is not serving any extra advantage that we set for a binary search tree which actually makes the insertion and deletion operations much more faster so one solution uh, to make this tree is to make the tree balanced okay so we will talk about this concept of balanced search tree in the next video thank you